I'm meteorologist Adam Stiles. We've got a pretty good layer of ice here on our uh, railing up on the deck. So freezing rain continues, but right now looks like it's back over to ice pellets. You can tell it's ice pellets because it bounces off. You don't hear freezing rain. If you hear something clanking on the window, those are those ice pellets. And we're just going to continue to change the precip type. In fact, we may get some plain old rain if the surface temperatures can get above that freezing mark here shortly. Winter storm warnings, they're still in place. Wind warnings into the Niagara region. Ice and wind are not a good combo on our tree limbs. We may see some power outages tonight. But it's a mess right now over the city of Toronto. Even some snow getting picked up by radar for areas north of the city. Quite a bit of ice pellets, and that's going to lead to some heavier accumulation for areas toward the north. And then you get into that freezing rain risk back in through the west end of the GTA where temperatures a little bit warmer but still at or below that freezing mark right at the surface. That cold air is still locked in for areas like Newmarket, Stouffville and Markham. Their temperatures right now are at about minus five to minus six here. We're at zero at the island. Meanwhile, it's one out toward Pearson Airport. As we look at the future temperatures, expecting a push of warmer air by about midnight tonight where we'll briefly warm up to two. And then all of that water freezes back up as we go into the morning hours. So untreated surfaces are going to be very slippery as temperatures stay below the freezing mark tomorrow. So we're going to play that game. Know your precipitation type here this winter. It started off as all cold air. Then we worked in a little bit of warm air. And this is what we have to set up right now uh, into the middle parts of the atmosphere. And then a deep enough cold layer to refreeze those melted snowflakes back into these ice pellets that are falling. Areas in the west end right now have a little deeper column of warmer air, but it's still cold at the surface, and we see that freezing rain. But if we can warm up those surface temperatures and have a column all the way right down to the ground of warmer air, we will see some plain old rain coming our way. Over the next 15 hours or so, here's the precip types you can expect. Some snow, some ice pellets. With that rain around midnight, back over to snow and some scattered flurries as we head in toward the morning hours. The morning commute is likely going to have delays, so give yourself extra time, especially if we can't get the roads salted and cleared out by that morning drive. Breakfast television, of course, will be on top of it.